Welcome back my friends, thank you so much for the support and all the views on and likes and comments on yesterday's videos and somewhat terrible suggestions for the wheel. So just to preface today's episode, we're halfway through the season, we are like 33% over our wage budget and to so to get rid of enough players, to sign players would almost be pointless. We'd have such a small squad. So we, it, we probably, it may be a loney, we won't be doing many signings. So the wheel is reflecting stuff that it's going to hit until the end of the season that's not really signing based because like for instance, one guy said, I had to sign players with Dick in the name. It's the sort of top notch comments that I come to you guys for, right? And there were some really hard meme ones and everything. So we've got a difficult enough job. So we're going to spin this wheel whenever we join a new club or at the beginning of a new season, okay? And unless otherwise stated, we're all sort of going. But there's some interesting ones here. We've got some sort of tactical stuff. Um, inverted wing backs. We've got three at the back. Number 10. Um, goalkeeper on the bench. <laughs> goalkeeper on the penalties. <laughs> That'll be quite a fun one. Um, the best... This is an interesting one. Best trainer start, somebody suggested. So, you know, you get that little report saying the highest scored trainer. They're going to start. I'm going to put some faith into those people that are working hard. Uh, wide centre backs. No, this is the Fergie rule. No one is bigger than the club. Sell, release your highest paid player. Oh, oh, was it? Yeah. Yeah, highest paid player. No, rated player. I can't even read my writing. So at the end of the season, which hopefully won't be a big issue for us because hopefully we're gone at the end of the season, not because we've been fired and relegated, but because, you know, Brazil have realised our greatness. So at the end of the season... We're just going to release the guy. <laughs> oh, that hurts. Um, this one's a little bit helpful for me. It's hard to read. Uh, Loki learns new language, which is nice, because that will really help us. Big Samet, self-explanatory. Um, or three or five at the back. We've got Strike. This one, I, I'm, I'm really scared for two reasons. I don't know how to do, or I have and never have really tried, strikerless tactics. Plus, all our best players are strikers. So, <laughs> don't want that. Uh, director of football takes over. That shouldn't be a problem because we haven't got any money. Uh, steroid abuser, plus one to all the tributes, but, you know, downside of drugs, kids. He dies at the end of the season. So, <laughs> I like this one as well. Two random players fall out and they won't play together. So for the rest of the season, I'm gonna, uh, I'll pick two at random and stuff. Right, there's no re-rolls on this, people. So we're gonna spin and then we're gonna get into the game. God help us all. Don't be strikerless. Anything but strikerless. Ready? A warm-up spin. Hold it. It's not, it's not the most... Okay. What colour is strikerless? <clears throat> okay, okay, yeah. Yes, yes, we like that. We like that. I really wanted to do that. Okay. The best... Don't do it, Wheel. The best trainer starts. Which, is yeah, I'm liking that. I like that. Because we don't want... The whole point of this little wheel is to do sort of fun stuff to it. It's not to, like, demolish the whole game and, and change the game entirely. It's just fun stuff. So I'm liking that. If I remember, is a, just another matter entirely. But let's get on with it. So, the first thing we need to worry about is rules. Because right down here, thankfully, it's on the main squad page. It says rules for the... Uh, under 21 players are automatically eligible to play in all matches. Under 21 players must be must play a combined total of 70% of the time played in 30 games. Currently, 99% target in th is 33 minutes a match. So an under 21 player... Well, we're going to play kids anyway, so it shouldn't be too much. If the minimum number of players in the match squad cannot be met, spaces must be left on the substitutes bench. Okay. Minimum of two, so minimum of two under 21 players in the match. They're born after the 1st of Jan. Okay. We don't have many good youngsters. Like, for some reason, our best youngster, arguably, that's under tw the only player that's under 21, was in the reserves. <laughs> Which is... So we can't sign anyone, and we don't have very many good young players. So... That's a solid start. As I was saying about the striker situation, um, yeah, we've got a few. You could argue eight. 
Um, it's half our squad uh, plays as a striker. <laughs> and also, like I was saying about wages, our wage budget is 7,000. We're spending 9,200. Now, I need to reduce that by 2,300. How do I get rid of that? Um, this guy, he's on 1,000, 1,100. He's our highest paid player. But then I'd have to get rid of three or four other guys? Five, six other guys? And we've only got like a week or so of the transfer window left. I'm maybe look for a loanee, but I'm just going to, we're going to go with the squad we've got, people. And try and make it work. I might try and cull a few of these and, you know, sneak in a loney or something like this. Finances wise, we saw that we're half a million pounds in debt. But the good thing is, it, our projection is half a million pounds in debt at the end of the season. And we have no debt. So it's, it's not all terrible. But like, as I said before, this is not a long term club, right? Because if we stay up, then... We get a bigger budget, but it still doesn't cover what we're paying now, next season. <laughs> so we could put a bit of wage, but, you know, if needed. There you go. Extra 600 quid a week in wages. So at least it gives me free reign to make a tactic. I don't know what tactic I'm going to make. We seem to be lacking. Just from this, just from glimpsing, we don't have many people that can play central midfield. Every motherfucker and their mum can play on the wing. Central midfielders is an issue. I think pretty much everything else we're covered with. Our first game is against Magalananas, um, who are sitting 11th. Okay, when is it? We've got four days or something, and we got no training time. This is ridiculous. I don't want to hit continue. Right, Team Cohesion. It's been better. Zero support. Because I do have a low reputation. Okay, this is... <laughs> I feel like we need to get off to a good start, otherwise we're fucked. I think the start of this... Our first three games, I think almost will decide if we're going to make a go of this, I feel like. Because if we just lose the first three, and then every even worse, and then we're, we're fucked. I'm like Rafa Benitez taking over at Everton. I've got no credit in the bank and everybody already hates me. So I have to prove them wrong with my superior tactical knowledge. I'm thinking, looking at the squad, I'm thinking more of a direct, more of a big Sam, not fully big Sam, like medium sized Sam, because we've got decent defenders. Fullbacks are a little bit ropey. Midfield, we've got one good central midfielder and the rest are attacking players. So we don't have a midfield, so let's bypass the midfield and just get the defenders to kick it to the attackers. It's actually a bit Man United, only got a soul show, isn't it? You know when he got a bit panicky and he dropped and he had that just one group of people defending and one group of people attacking and trying to hoof the ball to that. That's what we're going. <laughs> That's what we're doing. Um, unless there is any sort of... I don't even know what they, if they're going to require a ton of money for loans over here. You know how some countries you can get the loan and it's like, oh, it's great. They don't want any money. It's all good. I've only got my view. Okay, we'll worry about that later. Um, as for tactics wise, I'm not going to go for it. I'll show you my tactic at the end. They're suggesting route one. I've never gone fully route one before. I feel like it's terrible, but we are terrible. So maybe... It's a match made in heaven. Shit team, shit tactic equals good? Question mark? Hmm. What's... Maybe route one, but tone it down. I think we've got to play two up top because we've got so many good strikers. Or we play really attacking wingers. So we're basically essentially playing three strikers. Right. I'll come back to you with some ramshackle tactic ready to go. <laughs> oh, fucking... I don't know what to do. Pull it together, man. It's time to meet the players then. All right, lads. Let's try and uh, improve this support. Need to nail this. You know me, I'm great at these. Okay. Got two options. I like it. 50 50. Uh, yeah, there you go. Okay. Agreeable. Encouraged. Okay. We can't sign anybody. I literally just tried to sign a loanee and they were like, look, can you pay us 85 quid of his wages? And I'm like, I can't. 
there's, there's no way we can sign. So I can't promise signings. We don't have a good... You've got one half-decent young player. Okay. Uh, let's wait until the end of the season when I won't be here. What? Okay, we're promoted as champions. Um... There's to avoid me. I think. Okay, good. That is a target we can all get behind. Okay. We're on a roll. That's good. That's. Has it moved? <laughs> okay. So tactics wise, this is Big Sam. Big Sam version one. My version of Big Sam. Based on the root one. I thought we'd give it a go. It's not, it's not something I really... And I've tweaked it a tiny bit. But like... And some of the positions and stuff. But I, I went with the 4 4 2. I'm trying to use the players that we have. We don't have two central midfielders. We don't really have a good left back. We don't have a good right winger. We have a couple of good left wingers. We've got good strikers. So I'm kind of... Look at this group. They're the defence guys. They kick it to the angle for the three guys at the top. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm doing a bloody Oli Gunnar Solskjaer team talk with my tactical knowledge here. You guys kick it to those guys up there, the diagonal, all right? And then they kick it in the goal. But we're going to play defensive. We're going to see how it goes. We've got a few days until the kickoff. So they've got a few days to train it. Everything's going well like that. Playing for set pieces, classic. You know, we've got a decent target man. We've got a high paid player here. They're all pretty decent in the air without being spectacular. So I don't mind all three of our strikers are decent in the air. So that's that's pretty cool. Um, we've got Vilchez, who's our, he's our midfielder. <laughs> he's, he's our central midfielder. We've got the young guy that we brought forward because he has to play to get his minutes. And also because we don't have any other central midfielders. Originally, I planned to play him at left back. But we don't have any central midfielders. So he's just going to play as a ball-winning midfielder. Learn on the job. It's fine. But it gets it gets our minutes in. I don't have to worry about that. I was looking at players like this and going, ah, do we need this guy? We could probably sell this guy. But like, what? Just why? why? He's valued at nothing. I can't replace him. So I might as well just keep him. <laughs> he's on 210. He's not going to touch the sides. He's trying to make the money back. So we just have to ignore. I quite like the fact that I've not got signings to make um so everything's going well i just need to you know build a set piece one good result and team cohesion and managerial support shift hugely that's all we need in the next two or three games we've got we're playing 11th 10th so in the next two games we're playing 11th and 10th all right mid table is it mid table bottom half table we can smash them we're only a few points behind them Right, let's get to game day. Fingers crossed, everybody. We need to start with, a, like, at least a draw or something. Give me some hope. All right. It's game day. I've almost hired an assistant manager. Unfortunately, I went, you know, we need an assistant manager. So I did my searchy thing and I found a good guy. He looked all right. Solid, like nothing spectacular. I asked him how much he wanted and he wanted to get paid £3,200 a week. And all the other guys were like at least 600 quid a week and I can only pay £300 a week. So we found a shit one. Right, just a homeless guy off the street. I have no idea what to expect from this game. This is one of the blindest games I've ever taken part in. Not only have I joined a team halfway through, I haven't done any transfers. I don't know if there are any. And we have gaping holes in our team and an overflow of other random positions and a few grey players have turned up today. That's that's nice. Um, uh, you, your fitness is okay though. That's that's the main thing. Okay, everybody's back fit. <clears throat> our top goal scorer. So this guy that's supposed to be our star player that's, on, that's getting paid so much more than everybody else is... Barely played and not scored. And he's our key player. I think I found the problem. The biggest plus points. We've got a good goalkeeper. We've got two good centre-backs. We've got one central midfielder that's solid and a winger and, a, and some okay attackers. There are plus points. Full-backs, wingers, the other wing and depth, central midfield. Fucked. So... Should we just do it then? Should we just do it? How much money have we lost in between? Not too bad. That's okay. I did ask. I, I made the silly 
I made, I made the silly decision of asking the board if we could have a senior affiliate club, you know, because, because, you know, free money and players that we don't have to pay wages to. So I might actually be able to get somebody in on loan. Not having it. Not having it. Right. Okay. We need another under 21 player. I forgot that bit. Two in the, is it two in the starting 11 or two in the squad? I can't remember what it said. Match squad. Okay. Dump one on the bench. Not literally. That's. Uh... Oh, is that why they put these guys? Because these are. He counts. So he was born. Fifth of the second. So this Vega counts. Loney's count as well. They're like, that's fine, right? Okay, you're dog shit. So I'll just put it. That should be fine. Let's go. I'm a fucking numbers whiz. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. No idea what's about to happen. Okay, go out and play your own game. And by your own game, I mean Big Sam's game. Who is Big Sam, you ask? Doesn't matter. Very successful manager. Uh, don't look it up. Uh, what does it mean to you? Okay, I can't wait for the first whistle. Do you think the first goal generally is quite important because that's kind of the point, goals. Do you hope the team... No! I hope we do shit. Okay, next episode, we're going to look on Google Maps at this stadium. I wanted to not look, purposely not look at Google Maps, because I wanted, although this is not our stadium. Uh, no, it's our, this is our stadium, right? So I want to see it here, and then <laughs> look how lovely this stadium looks. I want to see it, what it looks like on Google Maps, and compare the two. So tomorrow, the next episode... We're gonna look. We're gonna look at Google Maps at our new stadium, and then we're gonna also need to find a place to live. Um, I'm gonna get. I want to go. Extended highlights for the first match, at least. Okay. Good luck, everybody. Why am I so nervous? What's the worst that can happen? We do shit and get sacked, and we're back to square one that we were anyway. Could you kick the ball any slower, please? Thank you. Jesus Christ. <sighs> right, what team are we? We're in the white and green. Let's go, team. Right, I'm hopeful of... I'm hopeful, despite the fact that our best striker's not played any football this season, he's going to be the man. Right, let's just make sure. So... Mm -mm -mm, can have a league table, that's fine. Match stats... Body language might be important. Okay, okay, 10 minutes in. No shots, that's the least surprising part of so far of this game. We're, we're not here to get a lot of chances, all right? What I wanted to do, tactically wise, my first thought tactics wise was I wanted to create an ankle at the back. I wanted to, get, so the left back bombs on, and the two central defenders move over a bit, right? And the right center, uh, right fullback who's on defend just shuffles a bit. So you become a three, like when we're going forward, right? Like you can't do that in Football Manager, can you? You can have a three and you can have wide center backs, but they're already a three or a five, aren't they? Like you can't do it in a four. So... I, can't, I don't think... You can, is there a way? Like, let me know. Is there a way to actually... Ha you know what I'm talking about? This sort of ankle joint that, that's very popular nowadays. I don't see... Is there a way to do it in Football Manager? Because I want them to shuffle across and become a three with the right back. Oh, it has to be a bloody set piece, didn't it? A howitzer? Fuck off. Howitzer. Edge of the box, mate. <clears throat> that's fine. They have to beat us with a set piece. In regards to the rest of the possession, 40% possession is fine for our tactic. We are looking for very rare, big chances where we're through on goal. Or win ahead. Or win a flick on. That's fine. 1-0 down. That's okay. I don't want to change things up too much because then I won't know if anything's working. So I want to kind of leave it a minute. Then we'll go the panicky attack route in about sort of 15 minutes time. 
It's not looked too bad though. It's not like there's it's been an onslaught. What I was worried about is that we we kicked off and they just kept attacking until we conceded. This game, they had one free kick. We've had nothing. It's kind of what I want to do. Keep it really tight and then nick games. But we've got to do the nicking. We don't want to be the nicky. Good ball. Good ball. We got right through. You're supposed to be a target man. Go on, whoever you are. Oh, this is my midfielder. Castillo. Vilches. Yeah, some of these names. Some of these names, people. Look at this. There's our youngster. Have to be really important. Diaz. It's a good ball. Go on. Oh, straight to the keeper. There's our superstar striker as well. The big, big money man. Oh, don't. It's not Gary, is it? Who's <laughs> Okay. Another set piece. I don't think this is too bad. We don't have a plan B yet for like at this point of a game. Like we're one nil down. What do we do? So we'll wing it, obviously, as always. Um, I'm going to need somebody much more attacking. Actually, you go on. I like you. More of a number 10, but actually almost decently two-footed. We'll keep you as a winger. Now, you need to bum on. Bum on? Bomb on, or bum on, so, you know, each to your own. Um, the right left back's playing shit, but he's also shit, and the only other guy is the only guy that can play central midfield. So what's worse, having a... Okay, fuck it, and you're the one. You're the most normal, although you are a balling your head. We'll fix that, don't worry. There you go. Don't worry about it. I feel like we've changed quite a lot of the tactics without the team really understanding the logic or trained at any point this tactic. I've just I feel like I've just clicked buttons here. I need to <laughs> I need to go and spend twenty minutes on working out what we do if we're behind. Another set piece. They've only they're all nearly all their chances have come set pieces though. They've had one shot on target. It's not that bad. As, as games go, not the most exciting. But it's not that bad. If we can nick one now, that would be a perf pretty perfect day. I'd take a draw on my first day in the office. Okay. Go on, you're decent. Garner. There's our striker. Go on! Oh, straight at the keeper again. Seriously. Aim at the big, anywhere else in the big white bit. I've just punched the wheel. Um, come on, one chance. All right. This, despite, okay, it might be two now. Uh, okay, that was not quite easy, wasn't it? Good save, though. Good save keeps. Gets his hands on it. I don't think this is too bad. I'll take, I would have taken it. I was so unknown going into this game as to what was going to happen. But a 1-0, pretty even game. Need to work on our set pieces and stuff, but that'll happen in training. Come on, boys, let's see a little flurry at the end. Let's see a chance. Good interception from Sabutio. I just saw SUB and I went Sabutio. <laughs> God whips it in. Oh my God. Not the guy in the red. It's like magnetized. Okay. Unlucky boys, but overall, pretty damn happy. Like, I'll take that. Yeah. Let's let's motivate the boys, okay? Let's only gonna soul shot this. We're just gonna no real tactical knowledge whatsoever. But I'm gonna try and be their friend and motivate them. And hopefully their own skills will be enough to win the day. Uh, we did enough to deserve a victory. When it's not your day, it's not your day. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, pretty sure I delegated this, but okay. Um. I just want to move on. 
Not so you're gonna, I'm just, I'm fine with it. Yeah, we'll get results. We'll get results. Don't worry about it, mate. Don't worry your pretty little face. Random, if you heard that noise before we finish up today, has any, is anyone getting like a Windows boom thing noise? Sometimes when playing Football Manager, I'll be hitting continue buttons and it's making the almost window like error noisy thing, that boom noise. Let me know if it's a thing. When I'm hitting continue throughout the week, it just keeps happening every few clicks. So that's strange. Right, you're suspended. Good. Save that up, did you? I think so. We're running out of time. Last one, so long I've seen. We can't do something. Don't say that, Daniel. Because we can't do any changes. <laughs> we can't sell anybody because we can't buy anybody. We just have a smaller squad for no reason other than just to have a smaller squad. Okay. But club atmosphere is good. We're going to have a nice temping bowling day. Going to have a lovely time. But I don't think it's too bad. And I'm we can. I'm going to go. I'm going to go on with this tactic. Course of the season, we've got plenty of time left. This is not. We're playing Rangers next. They're rubbish. Um, actually, we really need to win that game. It's only six points, everybody. It's only six points. Right. We are done with the day. I hope you enjoyed it. Just, just so you know, just so you're aware. This will change, you know, I'm going to put new stuff on it every time we spin it. So this was just for this one. So keep them coming. Not random things, really random things. Like, oh, you have to play, all your strikers have to be goalkeepers. I'm like, no, that's just going to fuck me over. Um, it does have a name chosen by the Discord family, the, the wheel of, I was going to call it Fumtune or Destiny or something. It is now Wheel Frid Boney. Because... Discord. Right, there we go, my friends. I hope you enjoyed that. We'll come back for two games next time, I think, tomorrow, because we want to see this club play. So tomorrow, we're going to have a look on Google Maps, have a little look at the stadium, and then we're going to, the meat of it is going to be two games where we can watch our team and see actually if it's any good or just shit on a stick. Right, thank you very much for watching. Please do leave a like if you enjoyed it. It helps with the algorithm and all that good. Go, just, just hit the like button. Just do it automatically at the start of videos, and then you don't have to think about it. That's what I do. Right. Thank you very much for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.